the young cars, last last, now everybody go to our breakfast. Shalom. Saturday and you're welcome to a new episode of Vlogmas. Um, I just woke up and it's uh, it's nine thirty eight. I slept late. Like I think I slept around past two yesterday. I didn't even know when I slept off. I was watching Stranger Things. Um, I'm on season three. Um, this morning I want to wash my bathroom. Yeah, I have a breakfast date this morning and I'm excited about it. I've never gone on a breakfast date before and I've never had breakfast outside before. But one of my friends suggested we do breakfast outside and I'm like, hmm, that's a nice idea. Um it's supposed to be by 10, but I can't meet up with 10. This is 9 40 already. I need to turn on music so I can get motivated. <laughs> This was not the plan, but I'm waiting for my friend to get here. He's coming to get me and then we'll go together. My friend is here already. So this is a fit. I'm wearing this play suit. Um, I'm carrying this black bag. You guys know this black bag. I just got it. And I'm wearing my black slippers. Nothing too so serious. I mean, it's just fast, but this time around brunch. So I'll see you guys later. You want to say cheese? Lights were blown to me, electric pulses from my veins. My eyes reflect the beauty you didn't give me the attention I was hoping for. Is it possible that you? I am 
him Don't you know that he was my man But I chose to let him go Why are you acting like I still love him so? Sunny So we are at Tutti Fruity Bas is taking me around Abuja today Just so you guys would know He wants me to try frozen yogurt for the first time And I'm ready to try it Thank you Don't you know that he was my man But I chose to let him go Why are you acting like I still love him so Looking at me like I'm hurt When I'm the one who said I didn't want it to work Don't you forget I had a first So this king, stop blaming me He wasn't man enough for me and if you don't know, now he's a chance I already had your man Hi guys, good evening. This place can be busy, eh? Can never, cannot be me. So I'm currently on my way to my volleyball get together. This one is actually not in my favor. What if you can ride this scooter? I don't know. <laughs> so I just got home. Changed and I'm back out there. You keep me such a because my hair is so rough. And I'm with Bassi. Bassi, say hi. I'm not say hi. <laughs> <laughs> I told you that I never would, I told you a change Even when I knew I never could, I know that I can't Find nobody else as good as you, I need you to stay, need you to stay, yeah Get drunk, wake up, I'm wasted Still I realize the time that I wasted Here I feel like you can't feel the way I feel oh, I'll be fucked up if you get me right here Good morning. This is the outfit for today. Today is Monday. I'm wearing this black top. Um, I'm wearing this um lilac-ish kind of skirt, and I'm wearing my flats. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, I'll be fucked up if you get me right here. I do the same thing. I told you that I never would. I told you a change. Even when I knew I never could, I know that I can't find nobody else as good as you. I need you to stay. with one of my friends he's into fitness too so plan on like doing a video and stuff <laughs> Been this swing like Django Lover 
Feelings been they swing like Django Lover Now you crash your Ferrari for Lecky Bona Now so much to you make it and been all over My feelings still they swing like Django Lover Feelings still they swing like Fitty Timbani Hi guys, so I just got home from the gym. I myself and my gym partners are three. We met at the gym and we just became friends at the gym and started working out together at the gym. So we we've been wanting to go out actually, but we just never went out. So I've been at the sleepover thingy today. So she just called me that she's outside. I just got back. So the other one came already and was at this other one's house. <laughs> so she just called us at my gate. So I'm going outside now to go open the gates and let them in making a video say hi hi <laughs> work today i'm excited bro because i was tired like you know when you're already in the holiday season like your whole your your mind your head like everything is already in the holiday season and just want to rest but then you still have to keep showing up at work it was a struggle waking up every morning to get ready for work like um i just woke up i woke up earlier like i woke up um at seven ish but I went back to sleep and I just woke up and it's currently 9. I need to go make my hair today. So um, I'll go to the market so I can get attachments. And then I'll go to the salon where I want to make my hair. Um, because I want to braid my hair so they can be done on time. Meanwhile, I need to send out my duvet and my teddy for washing. She has not been washed like since I got her. So and she's kind of dirty so i need her sparkling white again so i already packed my duvet and the laundry guy is supposed to come pick it up this morning i'm going to call him to confirm that before i leave the house then i need to wash my hair i didn't do my hair yesterday so my hair is going to be like a mess i need to wash my hair and i need to put up my christmas lights today i mean today is 23rd already so what am i waiting for exactly then what i've been lazy about putting up this like i'll try and put it up today meanwhile i got new i got new phone pouch yesterday so i got this one well, this one is overly shiny i don't even know why i got it but. then i got this one i got this one because of this ring thing here then i got this one i think this is actually my favorite because of the shape like i love how messy the shape is so i just pop it to like give you guys a breakdown of how my day is going to be today before i um head out mm -hmm. so i'm dressed to um to go out to the salon now since i was sitting down for long so i'm wearing this short morning t-shirt i tied this scalp because my hair is a mess and i'm wearing my black slippers nothing serious so this is the fit the laundry guy has still not come to pick up my duvet. So that is still lying there. It's almost 12.30. I hope I don't get disappointed when I get there and they tell me they are busy, they can't make my because I'm going to cry. <laughs> I'm literally going to cry, but let me hurry and head out now. Sit 
sleeping on me in my room again I'm trying to find the words to say but nothing comes out I am looking for the better day It seems like they just stay away whenever I try There's so many things that I keep in my mind My friends keep me out and it hurts every time With all the emotions I built up inside Oh why can't I? When someone looks for me and I disappear No matter how much that I scream, nobody hears But I see the light from far away, it's down the line Maybe I should not give up without a fight Cause there will be a time oh, 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 I'm so tired Whew, like I'm super tired I got to salon 12 12 did something or 12 40 or thereabouts but when I got there there were a lot of people like a lot of people and I went there, I was going there for the first time I've never been there before I didn't know what the place looked like so I didn't even know what to expect but I was thinking oh I'm just going to walk in and there'll be nobody there and I'll just sit down and start my hair but one more, it shocked me. Like when I got there, the place was crowded. The salon has like a nail section, has like a barbing section, a section rather, a nail section, barbing section, and then the hairdressing section. Like it's all in the same space. So there were a lot of people there trying to cut their hair. People were waiting, people were braiding their hair, doing their nails. And when I got there, like that there's no space yet. So I will have to wait. And I'm like, for how long? They was like, she can't see maybe two hours i'm like two hours but then i was there already that's one and then if i want to go somewhere else before i get there like that's wasted time and then i may not even get a slot so i'm like okay let me just wait so i thought okay can i just do my nails while waiting and she was like no the guy is busy and then he has like two other persons waiting I'm like okay fine i'll just wait so i just sat down and waited and when it was like two hours, I now walked up to her like, how far? Like, so like, let her check around again. And luckily for me, there was one girl that was like walking around, like asking, went to meet her, I was like asking who is next or something. And I'm like, okay. She's like, okay, you can attend to me. And then we started, the girl had to pick the attachment. We started here like four o'clock or past four. That's when we started. She was even really fast. Even though she had like people assisted her to complete the tips and all. But like i'm impressed the braiding is neat like it's actually very neat as you can see they did a good job but then i don't know how i feel about the size you guys i bought two big attachments and one small one and i have like a lot of attachments left like literally a lot like see this she didn't even open this one at all and like this is going to be enough for the next thing i'm going to make I had plans like okay the hair was going to be full because I wanted the hair to be full but apparently when you tell them the size you want is medium they also cut your hair medium with like with the experience I've had medium is meant to be the attachment size not the way you're cutting my hair but with their own the size like the size is both the cutting of the hair and the attachment if I had known that that was the case I'd have just told them small so it's going to be fuller but um, see this like I have a lot of attachments for my next hair and i'm not even joking the next time i'm going to do my hair i won't even need to buy attachment at all because this is going to be enough for my hair now i feel like i wasted money buying this attachment because it was so expensive and i bought two big ones and one small one i'm actually angry i'm gonna send out that money to something else if i had known but yeah that's what it is so i'm home i'm tired I want to eat. Um, my cousin sent me food, so I ate some of it while I was there. I have leftovers, so I'm just going to put that in the microwave and eat. Uh, I'll have lots of the shower first, but my hair is not completely dry, so I don't want to like pack it up and then have it all curled up. So I'll just I'll just eat first while waiting for the hair to dry properly and I can pack it up. 
what is what my hair looks like and actually i enjoyed their service like i was super comfortable and then the best part you guys i didn't have to give attachments for the hair at all all i did was sit and watch movies on my laptop well they made the hair like that's like the best part of it and i'm going to keep going to that salon like right now that's my salon like i can't even shout i'm all about soft life and 2023 like i'm making conscious effort to leave that soft life i don't want anything that's going to stress me at all like they don't charge as much i feel like it's almost the same thing like we're going to regular salon where you're going to be giving attachments one more but i like the hair apart from the fact that it's not full i like the hair I mean, meanwhile, you guys see my, my my hair has literally grown out so much that my roots are now black. Like I didn't even get to rock the whole dyed roots, and my roots are black already. My hair grew out really fast. I don't know if it's what, if it's the oil or the um, stuff I was applying on my hair that made it grow out, but my hair actually grew out very very fast. See, like I just like it's barely even a month like i think it's just a month since i dyed the hair and this is what it is but yeah i need to put up my christmas lights too so i'm gonna do that hi guys good morning um dressed to go play volleyball today it's currently eight o'clock and I'm just about to head out, so I'm just um, currently dressed to go do my lashes. Mm, my skin is skinning into <laughs> my forehead. I've ordered like five or over six bolts and Uber together, and all of them have been cancelling on me. I don't know what's going on, but my appointment was meant for one, and this is two, three. <laughs> This is to three. Oh my god, I got home, I was super tired, and honestly, I almost cancelled. But I'm like, no, let me just go and do this. But yeah, this is I'm turning with my foam pouch. Can you see that? I'm wearing this white, cute dress, my red slippers, and my black bag. Nothing too serious. It's really hot outside, and I didn't want to wear like shorts so. By the way, I ironed this dress, you guys. But apart from the fact that I hate ironing, this is one of those dresses that no matter how much you try to iron, they just don't look straight. And I'm not about to start doing all the water spraying and all of those shit. I don't have time for it. But let me see what I can do. I don't know what's happening with both and Uber, and I'm really exhausted. But I've gotta go. I would like me to. Hi guys, um, I've been home for I'm trying to block that light because it's reflecting. But yeah, I've been home for like um two hours plus now. So after I was done, I did my lashes, I did my nails, um, and I went out to have dinner. I don't know why, like I'm feeling so cold. Like my nostrils are literally blocked and dried um i don't know i feel very tired and sleepy i haven't had um a shower yet i've just been lying down in bed meanwhile i told the guy i wanted red then he can do whatever he wants to do and i ended up with ho ho <laughs> oh my god i have strength meanwhile i love my lashes i did like the classic um i did classic cat eye the guy was nice enough to give me a mascara one when he was done, he asked if I had one of these, and I said no. So he just gave me this. That whenever I do my makeup and all, I should just use this and brush. And I'm like, okay. But yeah, it's my first time ever. Oh, I think I should just lie down because I'm tired. So, mm -hmm. it's my first time ever doing um, the semi permanent lashes. And honestly, I like it. I told him I didn't want it full. I still want to put up my Christmas lights this night because <laughs> tomorrow is Christmas. Like, it's few hours, few minutes to Christmas, and I won't put up the lights. Why then did I buy it? Like, I've been so lazy and indecisive of where to put it. I wanted to put it like 
up really up but then my hands couldn't get there so i'm thinking i should just put it where my hands can get like i really don't know but i'll just figure something out but i have to put it up this night so i'm going to do that then i'll go take a shower and come and sleep because i have to go to church tomorrow hey guys i slept about while doing my lashes <laughs> There's a lot going on on my face right now that I can't even explain. This hair makes my head look small. I feel like my cheeks are a bit. what is remaining of the rice so far and i'm not done sharing yet and i made soup this is stew here my meat and chicken is here and i've kind of cleared up a bit but i'm not completely done yet more tired is an understatement now i need to take my baths and get ready to go out my dinner with my friend that came from lagos so I just need to take a shower, get ready. I'm never sure I'm going to wear makeup, but let's see how it goes. <laughs> 